let's take a look at an important point that the recent research has turned up about cooking and eating cruciferous vegetables like this red cabbage. Cruciferous vegetables are also called brassicas or coal crops. Here is a partial list of cruciferous vegetables like cabbage, cauliflower, kale, and collards, etc. See a more complete list in the description below. I want to share with you a tip on how to prepare certain vegetables so that their benefits are more available for you. And these vegetables are part of the cabbage family and also including broccoli, cauliflower, and something called broccolini. Recent research has shown that to get the full health benefits of cooked cruciferous vegetables, you either have to not cook and eat them raw or you have to cut them up into smaller pieces at least 40 minutes before cooking to activate an enzyme that will release the phytonutrient health benefits. I have a link in the description below to Dr. Greger's video explaining this in detail. Here are some examples of cutting up cruciferous vegetables. On the cauliflower, if it's a bigger stem end, I still use the stem and I cut that into smaller pieces. And then the florets, I'll cut into smaller pieces that will let sit for the 40 minutes that I mentioned. Now I'll show you how to cut up the broccolini. I'll just do it with one stem here and floret. I first cut off the very end because that's where it was cut and it's not very good to eat. Then this, even though this part is tough, the beginning of it, or the end, this end of it, I'll still use it, cut it up into small chunks. Now I'll set these aside, I'll make two groups, the florets here which are small, to, uh, I cut them up to smaller pieces and steam them last. I'll steam these bigger pieces first, um, I'll give them more time in the steamer. I'll, men I'll mention again that this is all cut up at least 40 minutes before your meat. Forgot to cut? Don't worry. Just add a pinch of mustard powder or wasabi powder to get the full benefits. <laughs> 